I, I continue to learn that in this entrepreneurship journey, you're going to make mistakes. In fact, in life, you're going to make mistakes. Um, but, but forgive yourself. Forgive yourself for not being the richest, the thinnest, the tallest, or the one with the best hairstyle. Forgive yourself for not being the most successful, the cutest, or the one with the fastest time. Forgive yourself for not winning every round um, as you thought or as expected. Forgive yourself for being afraid, uh, for being scared, for, for, for freezing. Forgive yourself for not having achieved that dream. Forgive yourself for, for lagging behind, for despite all your best efforts, um, you could not reach the milestone that you have had hoped for. Forgive yourself for not meeting expectations, for not being perfect enough, or for not being ideal enough. Forgive yourself for the mistakes that you've made, for the judgment errors, for the things that uh, you didn't take serious enough. Forgive yourself even for the mistakes that you're still going to make in the near future. Forgive yourself for not being funny enough, for not being smart enough, or for not being popular enough. Forgive yourself for not meeting the spec as required. Forgive yourself for not knowing what um, you did not know before you even landed. Um, forgive yourself for all these things that you did not know, all the things that happened that you could have dealt with them differently. Um, forgive yourself for all those things, but don't let yourself off the hook. Never forgive yourself for not caring or for not trying. Forgive yourself for all those things, but never, uh, uh, never stop trying. Always try your best. Always keep um, uh, your, your face, um, you know, look at the bright side and always try your best. To live is to forgive. Um, you know, we are always asked to forgive. We are always asked to forgive others. But one of the things that we need to learn to do is to also forgive yourself, uh, but never stop trying your best. Just about everyone we know, um, you know, we are very hard, pretty ruthless when it comes to judging ourselves. Uh, and those judgments can derail our projects, our creative processes in general, stopping us from pushing through to doing what we need to do, uh, or even to fall in love, or even to venture out. Um, when we are hard enough on ourselves, we tend to derail ourselves. So apply confession to yourself for all the things you, you think are so terrible at. Apply compassion to all the things that you feel um, that uh, you know you have add on, but while continuing to try, to try and do what's important, meaningful to yourself and to those who are close to you. We are not perfect beings. We tend to always be hard on ourselves when we don't achieve our goals and or when we let others down. Be gentle first with yourself if you wish to be gentle with others. So how, how do you forgive yourself right now? Um, you feel like you know, you've made a mistake in business, at work, in life, you have made, you have um, uh, disappointed others. Um, you know, accept yourself, number one, accept yourself and your flaws. Know that despite your flaws and your weaknesses, you are okay as you are. Um, number two, remember that you're not a bad person. Uh, you can do something wrong while still being a good person. So you're not a bad person. Number three, Talk to someone, you know, sometimes you just need to get it off your chest. Talking to someone else about something that's bothering you can have serious benefits. Um, number four, talk to your internal voice. What is your internal voice saying? And listen to your internal voice. Often our internal voice knows the truth. It knows that you're not a bad person. It knows that you tried your best. It knows that despite all this that's happening around, you have a good heart. So sometimes talk to your internal voice. 
Uh, number five, you know, do the what we call the best friend test. Imagine your best friend had done exactly what you did and then came to you for advice. What would you tell them? You would, I'm sure you would reassure them and tell them not to be so hard on themselves. You would tell them that everybody makes mistakes. You would tell them that they deserve to be forgiven. Why can't you say that to yourself? Number six, volunteer to do good, help someone, um, guide someone, share, mentor someone about uh, what you think they would need. When you help others, you tend to also feel good about yourself. You tend to feel that you're not so bad after all. So number six, also help others. Forgiving yourself is far more challenging than forgiving someone else because you must live with yourself and your thoughts 24 seven. Despite the challenges, build the capacity to forgive yourself when you have made a mistake. Even you forgive yourself, you are not pretending as though it never happened. On the contrary, you are acknowledging that your actions have consequences, but the consequences did not, need not include self-inflicted negative uh, feelings. You made a mistake, you are not a mistake. It is okay to forgive yourself, but it is not okay to stop trying to achieve the best in ourselves and in others. Forgive yourself and stay the course. Never stop caring, never stop trying your best. Thank you so much.